Hello and welcome to part 9 of Assassin's Creed Liberation HD. Alright guys, welcome back. Okay, so we're back home now. In the last episode we were in the jungle, but now we are back home. And we're headed to the De Gompre Mansion. Which is... 200 meters away. Sorry guys, coming through. Actually, that was kind of skilled. They didn't hit me at all. Excuse me. Oh my god, I am amazing. What the hell happened here? Was this you? He's looking at his apple. He's looking at his apple and he's just standing there casually like he didn't do this. You did do this. You're just you're just playing the innocent guy. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> I didn't actually mean to do that. Did I knock his apple out of his hand? I don't know. What the hell? What are you, what are you guys doing? Guys, stop it! Who oh, sure that's wise, Senorita? You are not worth the trouble. Get lost. I'm quite lucky, actually. None of those guys just attacked me. And I think I took out the wrong person. But do you know what? Never mind. It looks like that's all barricaded off, and I can't actually get over there. So we're gonna have to go round, unfortunately. How annoying. Yeah, those guys there. They're the people that were going to come after me, but in actual fact they didn't. Um, so let's just try not to draw too much attention to ourselves that way. And uh, continue on, shall we? To the Degompria Mansion. You know, like we are actually supposed to be doing. And you might not have realised, guys, but I have a... Whoa, what's this? I have some loot. <laughs> Apparently. 1500 loot? What? That is incredible. I didn't think you could just randomly find 1500. Alright, never mind. What I was going to say is, um, you. Oh, for God's sake, there's another obstacle. What I was going to say oh, is, I have a new headset. In case you haven't realised, my other headset broke. Tragic story. Truly tragic. The wiring, uh, kind of just, I don't know, just kind of broke, to be honest with you. But this is a new headset. I paid quite a bit of money for it, unfortunately, but it's actually pretty nice. Um, if you want to know what the headset is, I'll, I'll put some description uh, down in the uh, description box, and then you can obviously find that out for yourself if you want to buy a headset like mine. But we are here. I don't think if that, I don't know if that was the shortest route we could actually take, but we're here nevertheless, so let's go. <sighs> okay. <laughs> oh, wow. Hello. Hello, hello. This is fancy. I live in the fanciest place ever. Well, what happened outside all of a sudden? <laughs> it's like a zombie town outside now. This is a magic house. This is like house moving castle, actually. Everything outside is slightly, you know, different. <laughs> It's a great film, by the way, if you haven't seen it. Avelyn, out and about as always. But home to rest now, Papa. Monsieur Blanc tells me you do a great service to my business. To our business. For it will be your husband someday. Oh, Papa. You know I should sooner mind my own business than marry. As stubborn as your mother, Jeanne. If only she could see you now. But she can't. No. But... Perhaps you are old enough now. It is not much. One page. But it is from her diary. You should have it. Mama. Thank you, Papa. Much respect, my friend. Much respect. Why don't you give that to me to begin with, actually? It's my mum's diary. Why the hell have you got it? Wait, take the diary page. I just took it, didn't I? Okay, right. Well, I've got it now. That's the main thing. We've got a full sink. Check us out. We're badass. Ah, I actually really like it here. I listen to the music as well. It's just so... So relaxing. So beautiful. 
Fancy bed, fancy chairs. What the hell am I doing? I'm playing Assassin's Creed for crying out loud. Let's go. Jump down the stairs. Oh no, I can't. I'm in a dress. Ah, Alright, fine. Fine. Oh wow, that's a fancy bed as well. Oh, my god. There's a fireplace in every room as well. Oh, such lovely books and a lovely desk. Um. Oh man, I shouldn't be getting sidetracked like this. Even the chandelier. Oh. Alright. What's in here for me? Start the memory. What, with the piano? Really? I can play the piano? That's amazing! Whoa. Well, where the hell did she come from? Papa, you surprised me. I dared not interrupt. Your music is breathtaking. I dare say you could stop a man's heart. You flatter me too much, Papa. The credit belongs to my teacher. I am but an instrument of his will. How blessed we are with a daughter who uses her talents in peace, not to riot in the streets of New Orleans. There is so much unrest since the arrival of the Spanish. Well, I don't want to keep you from your practice. I simply came with a message from Monsieur Blanc. At your leisure, he requests your assistance at the warehouse. Do take care when you go. The streets are not safe for a lady. No need to worry, Papa. I will try to restrain myself. I know your charm and grace will protect you like armor. I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. I will be fine. <sighs> Take one last look at this place before I go. So beautiful. Avalyn, your music could stop a man's heart. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet. No, I mean you could kill a man. <laughs> Is he jumping out there? 60 meters away. Alright. Investigate the commotion. Okay. Hello. Whoa, what is going on over here? Bonjour, what are you guys doing? Torturers! Kidnappers! What? What are you guys we doing? We demand answers! Guys? Unwashed scabs! Go back to your swamps! Guys, what are you doing? How many more will disappear? Get back, or I'll give you a reason to protest! Seriously, guys, what are you doing? You have These guys have guns! Oh, crap! Oh, oh, what the hell, man? I just said to my father I'd be okay. Well, my papa. But, still, I just said I'd be okay. And... Then I got stabbed in the tits. <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa, man, stop it. Enough! The man is down. Don't abuse what little power you have. Alright, let me go! Yeah. Now, what's this all about? People have been turning up missing, or... Not turning up, rather. That's why we... But you have proof the Spanish are behind it? Kidnappings have increased since they got here. Increased? Life was never easy. Now, it's worse. Rioting will only worsen your plight. You need evidence. And how are we going to get that? I... I don't know. Yet. Some help you are. Okay. So I used my fist to knock out the opponents. And while I'm here, I'm gonna loot your ass. Take whatever you have, even if it is only 41 gold. I don't care. <laughs> and then I need to talk to Gerald at the warehouse. Which, where is he? He's over in that direction. Oh, I know, I can buy this, can't I? Yes. This should just be a dressing chamber, right? Where did she come from? She's the magic dressing chamber lady. Hello! Welcome! Would you like to buy a dress? Get out of here! She just magically appeared in front of me, what the hell? <laughs> Alright. Um, yes, this is... I don't feel the need to change, although it would be nice. I would like to wear my assassin's gear. But... We can't draw too much attention to ourselves. Not just yet. Is that another obstacle? Hang on a minute, can I get through? Please? 
Yes, I can. Oh, an obstacle I can actually go through. What is that noise? Do you know what? I'm not gonna... I don't think I'm gonna help you. I, actually, yeah, I will. Alright, fine. I just realised something. The last guy that I did that to, I was actually, um... I was actually doing everyone a good favour, because I don't think these guys are very good. Oh, that was a long groan. Right, where's the... <laughs> where's the warehouse? Oh, there it is. Somebody's screaming their head off. But never mind. Let's just enter the warehouse and see what's in here. We're supposed to be meeting you here, aren't we? Where are you, Gerald? What the hell are you doing in here? Oh, you guys are just working here, aren't you? Alright, well, it looks like we're going up. We are going up. Ah, Aveline. Hey, Gerald. Oh, good day. I have a, a surprise for you. What do you think? To the unknowing eye, an unassuming warehouse, but to our brotherhood, your new headquarters. Oh. Agati takes his office in the swamp, but we thought you might prefer this for your business dealings. Oh, nice. <laughs> Got my own headquarters. I feel like a total boss now. Oh, thank God they didn't get me one in the swamp. That From this disastrous. desk you can manage, or better still, expand your family's trading empire. Oh, really? Are you kidding me right now? What? New port unlocked Havana. What is all this? Buy goods, buy ship. Whoa, man. Really? Well, so I can I can buy my own ship. So there's a ship there called uh, the Galleon, I think. But I can buy goods. Oh, I can buy cotton. I don't know if I'm going to need cotton, but just in case, I'm going to buy like I don't know. Uh, oh god, you can only buy it in quantities of ten. Okay, fine. I'll buy ten then. Um, that'll do, I think. I don't want to go too overboard, I might not even need this stuff. Oh man, that's incredible. Whoa, that's going to come in handy. Okay. What else, Gerald? This room is all yours. <laughs> and all of your guises are kept here. Oh, nice. Over here, you have a private place to change your guise. As long as you don't pee. And that's... most importantly, your weapons and tools will be kept here. That's <sighs> good. It is to your liking, then. It's perfect. It's really good. In that good. case, I will leave you a quiet moment to familiarize yourself with everything. Oh, thanks, Gerald. You are a boss. Oh, so I have everything I need right here now, instead of having to muck about everywhere. Ah, oh, that makes so much... That makes so many things easier. Oh man, I'm gonna have some fun with this. <laughs> oh man, this has been a short episode. I, I wasn't really expecting it to be this short. It's been a lot of, like, cutscenes and that. Avin, I've, um, concocted a special instrument for you. Uh, okay. parasol? I suppose I should thank you, but... Allow me to uh, demonstrate. It's an umbrella. What are you doing? See? What? Elegant and deadly. Just like my lady. Monsieur Blanc, you do know me so well. Ah! All right. Um, so, business. Do you recall our rival, Monsieur Boucher, who was twice caught watering his wine? Up to his old tricks again? Now he claims our coffee erodes the nerves. He has erected a stall in the market by the docks and distributes handbills to that effect. Sales are impacted, and we have enough trouble keeping money in the company as it is. Say no more. I'll see to it that he ceases to slander. Sounds good. Sounds very good. Well, <laughs> I could say not much has happened during this ep episode, but actually quite a lot has. Um... 
as you can see, I have so much stuff that I can now use now. It's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Okay, um... Well, this is where I'm going to be leaving part 9. So, hopefully you guys are enjoying Assassin's Creed Liberation HD, and you'll join me for part 10. So, thanks for watching everybody, and I'll see you all next time. Take care. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. What, what the hell? Jumping straight into this, I see. Freaking hell, where is he? There's a zombie in this room. Where is he? Ah! <laughs> um. Oh crap. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What do I do? There's a lamp. Pick up the lamp and throw it at his head or something. Do anything. Anything in your power. Or else you'll be eaten. But there's a small medical kit. Thanks for the heads up. I'm probably going to need it now.